so hello friends welcome to our channel vijay experiment session so today we are going to see how to use the ch instrument and also the ch software so this is the ch instrument what we have and uh, this is our desktop where we have this ch software this is the ch software and in this video we will see how to use the ch software with ch instrument so let's open first this ch software now you will see this window now just cancel this and go to setup first we need to do this hardware testing now a window will open and you can see all are ok here then press ok then go to technique and whatever technique we want to do first of all we will do this cv then in parameters we can set up the parameters we are taking the parameters from minus 1 to 1 then to minus 1 and final potential is to 1 and first of all we will do the scan in positive region by taking the scan rate of uh, 50 millivolt per second and let's increase the potential limit to into 10 to the power 3 that is milliampere and just start So this is the CV graph which is been recorded. Now we will save this graph. Go to file, save as and let's save this. We will give it name CV and then save. Now let us do another experiment that is LSV. We will take here LSV from minus 1 to plus 1 at the scan rate of 100 millivolt per second and sensitivity equal to ampere that is 10 to the power 3 and just start this is lsv graph now let us save this graph also go to file save as and we will give it name lsv and then save now we will do another experiment that is chronoampirometry ok we will give it initial potential we will keep it zero then we need to take high potential let's take 0 0.002 and now zero scan will be taken in positive region and number of step whatever we want according to our condition let's take one 
and pulse width that is we will take uh, 100 second you can take this parameter as per your convenience also and the potential also as per our requirement and let's start this Okay, this chrono amperometry recording has been completed now. Let's save it. Now, let us take another experiment that is uh, impedance versus AC impedance. Let's take plus a first AC impedance by this. We can record the EIS experiment. Now let's take initial potential D0 and we need to make this high frequency that is 10 to the power 6. Just add one zero here more. And okay. Let's start.
now the es has been recorded now to check the graph of es let's click here to this graph menu and you will see the eis graph okay now let us record another experiment that is impedance versus potential let's take initial voltage minus 1 and final voltage that is 1 and rest of the things we don't need to change and by recording this experiment we can plot the mod short keep plot Now the impedance versus potential graph has been recorded and by clicking on this graph we can see the graph of the material and let's save this by ms and save. So in this way you can record you can perform all the experiment and there are many other experiment which can be performed. So one more thing we can do here uh, if you want to smoothen the graph we can smooth that graph in this software only let's first record one graph of LSV so now let's see this graph now we want to smooth this so just go to this icon and press here change the value here and you can see the graph is been smoothing for more smoothing change this value again and press ok now you can see the graph is smoothing by increasing this value ok that is fine now just save it So thank you friends for watching our video. Please do like, share, comment and subscribe to our channel if you are not subscribed. Thank you.